There's something different about you today, Ezio. What is it? Did you get a haircut? No. No, that can't be it. Oh, you got new clothes! Wow! Look at that new getup. Hey everyone, what's up? It's Queer to you, and welcome back to Let's Play Assassin's Creed 2. I decided that after the first 10 parts, it was time to get a bit of a makeover, so we have dyed our clothes to Florentine Crimson. I thought that would be appropriate, so let's go ahead. Uh, today I want to get started by going into a Templar lair, if that is available to us at the moment. And it is. Uh, last time we did an Assassin's Tomb, so I decided that this would be fitting for today. So let's jump in, shall we? Hmm. Seems a little odd. Home invasion. In 1479, infiltrate Palazzo Medici and save Lorenzo from the Templars. Alright, sounds like a plan. So we're in a restricted area now, which means if people see us, they'll get pissed. Speaking of which... Is anyone home? Hello? Oh god, that guy's dead. That's a problem. What happened here? Signor Lorenzo! Oh, now that's just gonna alert everyone. Lorenzo's currently indisposed. Hey, you're the one who killed Francesco de Pazzi. Get him. With pleasure. Uh-oh. Really, guys? You really want to play this game? You really want to play this today? What the hell? Let's try this again with a counter. Come on, guys. I dare you. Come on. I can take you all down. Oh, what the... Okay, you're done. Get out of here, fool. Come on. I don't got all day. Come on. You guys gonna fight? Alright, I'm getting sick of this. Let's go with our sword. Come on. Get out of here. You buffoons. I am so tired of this, and my button mashing has just gotten to the point where I'm just gonna kick you. Take you down. Hit you again. I'm going to grab and kill. Nope, just kidding. Man, the sound is being really weird. <laughs> Holy shnikes. Come on, come on, Ezio, you got this. That button mashing ability is how you kill people, right? Oh, he is done. Alright, so it sounds like Lorenzo's in a bit of a bad place. Probably because he is. Alright, so let's figure out where we need to go. We came in through this way. Uh, there's a few different ways we can go, it looks like. Actually, that's a lie, there aren't, but it appears that we can get up here. So we're gonna have to find our way around this place, otherwise we're gonna be in trouble. Here we go. And I'm sure that that won't be the last of the guards, I'm sure there'll be a few more kicking around here and there. But let's find our way across here first. The, usually when there are birds, um, they tell you where to go. That's usually a good indicator for where you should go. I hope I'm not just going in a circle and looking dumb. I really hope that's th not the case, because that would be dumb of me. Uh, no, I'm not going in a circle. I'm actually going the right way, I think. Yes, I am. Wait, what does this do for me, though? Can I go some- Oh, okay. I was so confused for a minute there. I was just like, uh... Let's see, are you sure you know what you're doing there? I'm trying to drop here. Drop! And we made it. What do we got here? Ooh, lots of guards. Only one. Just kidding, not lots. And there's a lever. So what we should probably do is be smart and be like, throw me knife. Get out of here, dead man. You're a dead man. Oh, come on, Ezio. Get better with your aim. Oh, wow, that was a waste of a knife. Okay, well, we only have three now. That's a problem. Oh, well. Can I, can I loot these guys? Is that permissible? I can loot them. I wonder if they have knives on them. I haven't been doing much of this. They do have knives on them. <gasps> that changes everything because now I don't have to care as much. <laughs> Alright, so now we got that storming knives. We can go ahead and interact with this. Pull it down and let's see what we got going on here. Ooh, the painting moves. That's strange. Alright, well, now we just gotta get ourselves up there and of course it's not gonna be that easy. What was I expecting this to be? Like, uh, something else? Yeah, that's exactly what it was. <laughs> Come on, dude. If you're gonna make a reference, you gotta at least reference something 
legitimate instead of just being like, it could have been this and not that. I thought you could <gasps> grab that. That's really sad. Wait, how am I supposed to get over there then? What? What? Wait a minute. Did I go the wrong way? I might have gone the wrong way. You definitely have to go up here. That much is very clear. Um, I thought you could grab on those. Apparently not. Okay. Well, let's figure out a way to do this then. Because i got to get up there. Do I do this? Yep. I always forget that you can grab onto these paintings because they're magically, like, bolted into the doors and stuff. Like, who would do that? That seems like a... That seems like it would be bad if you're going to move. Although, to be fair, I don't think these guys are planning on moving anytime soon, to be honest. Go to the second floor. Well, that should be pretty easy considering there's a ladder. And it was trying to get me go the wrong way. There's a treasure here. Treasure, there you are. You thought I was going to miss it, guys. You guys are you guys are a bunch of funny guys, aren't you? Oh, what the? I thought I could... Wait, what? I thought I could get up there, though. How do I go? How do I do, game? Game, how do I do? Uh, I thought I could just go up here from here, but... Oh, right. Now I remember. Okay. Now I understand. Oh, there's a lever here. I don't know if I need this, actually. Secret area located, and there's a lever. What does it lead to? It opens that door, which opens up... Oh, a couple of treasures. Wow. I didn't actually know about that. I just kind of assumed that it was up there. All right, well, let's go ahead and head on down and recover our treasure because I didn't know it was there, honestly. I haven't really been using a guide yet, um, and I'm not really planning to until closer to the end of the game to figure out, like, glyphs and um, feathers and stuff. Um, and I'm just trying to do other stuff as I can. I know I heard a noise down there. It's time to earn your Florence. I want half of you to search the courtyard, the other half come with me to check the chapel. See, si, Capitano. Then we check the secret passageways. What about Lorenzo? By now, Lorenzo is already dead. Oh no, that's really bad. I don't like that. Lorenzo's dead? Oh no, okay. Well, let's go and kick some ass then. In his honor. In your honor, I will find today. If you go after if you go after me, dude, I'm going to counter the hell out of you. Come on, pal. You know you want it. I know you want it. You're a good girl. You're dead. Oh, screw screw off, guy. Come on. We gotta finish you off, dude. Oh what? Since when are you good at this? I'm trying to just take out this dude right here. Cause otherwise this is gonna take a while. Man, I have, like, no actual skills at this game. But I'm really good at doing that. That's all that matters, in my opinion. Oh, what the shnikes is this? Okay, we're playing the defensive game, then. Alright, come on. Come at me, bro. You're done. Goodbye. <laughs> Silly buffoon. You should not have messed with the best. I'm gonna see if I can pick up a few more throwing knives real quick here. Real quick lack and stuff. I wonder if the, the captains probably have more money on them is my bet. And more items. Because they are harder to kill. Or just completely not. I could just be 100% wrong. That's always a possibility because logic in this game. Uh, so it was showing us to go through a window. Through the wall. Um, but I'm also hearing noise. Is this a way to get back? Or did, am I just going the wrong way? I might just be going the wrong way completely. Uh oh, they opened the door. Okay, never mind. I don't need to go here. Run up the stairs, Ezio. It's like the spiral staircase in a lot of video games because that's a commonly deployed uh thing. Um <laughs> anyways, let's go ahead and figure out where it is I need to go. Is it here? It's here. Okay. I knew I was around it. Yeah, let's not fall. Let's not play the Fallen game. Let's play the I'm better than you game. So I'm going to get to Lorenzo really quick. Game. Man, why would you put the name game in there? Really, guys? You want to play this game? Done. Bad chance, pal. Not sure who you thought you were messing with, huh? 
Well, Lorenzo ain't taking crap from no one. You're done. You're done, skis. Oh, that was tough. All right, so now that we got that taken care of, let's see if we can find a few more places here to kick around. Oh, come on, game. Really? Oh, God. This, this is just the worst. Okay, there we go. Easy enough. We're up the book. Up the bookcase. I probably went the circuitous route, but I don't really care, to be honest. Are there people over there? There are. Huh, interesting. I'm going to have to fight them very soon, aren't I? Uh, let's see. What do we got over here? We got a bookshelf, I guess. Come on, Ezio. Come on, Ezio. Come on, Ezio. Where are the Difference. Wait a minute. Could be him. What is your business here? To kill you, fool. You won't You're dead. Who do you think you are? I'm now going to loot your body. And now I'm going to pick you up, if I can. If it lets... Oh, nope, he's just in an awkward position now. Access Lorenzo's secret hideout. Okay. So we gotta find the hidey hole. I said swing, Ezio. Thank you. Holy shnikes. Please die. God damn it, game. It's not intuitive enough. I'm assuming we'll have to go outside real quick. Let's see. We got birds. And the bees. And the bees and the birds. Uh, Ezio's, Ezio's sex talk. That's what this game is. I knew it. I knew this. that's what the game was all about from the get-go. Gosh darn it. Oh boy. That's no good. Lorenzo! Porca vaca. Someone, find a way to get inside there. You heard him? You two, get the ladder! Hmm. That's problematic. <laughs> hey, look, it's a lever. We're gonna have to go get that, aren't we? Oh, Schnipes. Wesley Schnipes, yeah. Oh, they didn't teach me. Oh, God! Oh, boy. I bet I better just book it. Ah da 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 Get in the way from the evil inside. Master! I can't see him anymore! Too bad. I don't have any stuff to use. Oh boy, okay. So now we're in the bedroom. The boudoir. There's gotta be a way to go up here. Yeah, this is it. Or is he? Or is he? What are you questioning my abilities? Come on, sir. I'm just jumping. <laughs> it's so much faster to do it that way. The game, like, doesn't teach you a lot of these techniques until later. Which I can understand because it... Once you get to those later stages, you actually need the advanced techniques. But knowing them early on is actually very helpful. Like, I've been doing a lot of jumping and stuff. Oh, so I opened it. Yay, I did it. I really hope they don't get to him first, though. Oh, shnike. Why are you hanging from there, you fool? Okay. I have to figure out how to get up there while dealing with idiots. Okay. I figured it out. That was really quick. Okay, we're going. <laughs> fool. Oh, no! I went the wrong way. Oh, God. This is gonna hurt. Come on, Ezio. Would you jump? Oh, my God! You're killing me, Ezio. Sometimes I wonder Anna, what goes through that head of it? yours. I tell you what. Okay, where am I going? I'm going over yonder, right? That's what I thought. Okay. At least they don't have rocks here, so they can't even hit me. I'm going to heal up real quick, actually. Because otherwise... Oh, they do have rocks. Well, that's scary. Get up, get up. Up, up, and away. Up, up, and away. Oh, boy, we made it. Okay, well, screw off. Because you guys can't get up here because you can't jump. Because white men can't jump. Let's drop down. Do -do 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 drop down. We did it. <gasps> Are we in? We're in. It looks like it. Is this it? Did we do it? We did it. Get back. Lower your sword. It's me. Ezio. Again you saved me. First they enter my church. Now my home. I'll hunt them down. They won't come near you again. Look around you. This is one of my treasure rooms. You're entitled to take anything you wish from it, in thanks for what you've done. I trust my apartments are safe now. Yes, signore. Thank you for this most gracious gift. I must go. 
But I will come to you again when all the Pazzi are dead. Sounds good. So it looks like we did this all I for will a not bunch forget of treasure. What done for me. Buena fortuna. And buena fortuna to you as well. Hopefully you don't uh, end up in this situation again. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to have a talk with those Templar fucks. Uh, screw them. I don't like them. Okay. So, we did all of this to get a lot of money, and money is power, because power is a thing here. I pressed it. Okay, there we go, game. Took you a minute to register. So, these are Templar treasures. These aren't regular assassin treasures. Like, you can go ahead and get a lot of money out of that. I don't know how much it's going to give me, or what it gave me, honestly. Yeah, it gave me a lot of money for that, um, but that's about all you get out of these. So... I think they're optional. You don't have to do them, but I want to. Memory synced. Lorenzo saved. Maybe they are not optional. I honestly don't know, to be quite honest. Because honesty is honestly... Um... Something. Um... <laughs> Alright. Well, we've got that synced. Alright. So we got a treasure down here real quick. I just want to pick that up. And we've got enough time to do just a couple of other things. So I think we will today um, get a couple of other things down. Uh, right after I get this treasure, let's go ahead and look at the map real quick and see what we've got available to us. Uh, we've got the Assassin Tomb. We've got another memory. And we've also got a few assassination contracts that we can do. Um, I think right now I'm going to go and do this assassination contract and I will meet you over there. Okay, I like pickpocketing random guys too that aren't real, that are just invisible. Alright game, um, so we're here, and I'm gonna go ahead and start this assassination contract real quick by going to the pigeon coop and being like, Pigeon, what you got on your mind, dog? Let's see what it's got on its mind. Political suicide. A member of the Signoria was working with the Pazzi to turn the tide against our family. He's located near the church of San Lorenzo, but kill him silently. He has pow powerful friends. Lorenzo. Alright, looks like we're gonna have to do a silent but deadly kind of thing. Ah, fart jokes. Those are so funny. Anyways, um, so let's get ourselves over to that area. I have no idea where it is, to be honest. I'm just gonna go the easy way. <laughs> Never doing in the sleazy way. All I think of is Tupac and changes, but not the changes by David Bowie. Oh God! Ch -ch 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 changes. Oh my God! What are you doing, Ezio? Holy shnikes! All right, well let's go ahead. We gotta find this guy. We gotta kill him silently, um, while my guitar gently weeps. You know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking anymore. I just, I'm spouting off words and trying to figure out why this mission was placed so far away from the other. You know what? I was going to do this after the mission, but on the way there, I want to see if we can get any new stuff. I'm going to repair everything real quick first, and then I'm going to see if we can get stuff. We can get Greaves or we can get Van Braces. We can also pick up the Florentine Falcon. And also the captain's sword, but the falcon is a little better, in my opinion. So we got options. I'm going to go with the weapon. I could go with the armor and increase our health a little bit. No However, I am in the, the <laughs> respect that... Words. I, I think that having a better weapon will help a lot more. So we're going to use that weapon. Probably not even in this mission, though. Of course, I still have to find the freaking mission. Because they make you run across town. Like, what the hell, man? I would have figured that it would have been close by instead of close to the other assassination contracts. But it's like next to the other assassination contracts. Okay, we're in the area now, at least. I don't want to go there. Okay. So now that we're in the area, let's turn on our eagle vision real quick and see if we can see our target really quickly. There's red. Let's see. Where is he? I was going to say, my bet is he's in there. Kill the target without being detected. There's got to be... Mercenario. Sounds good. Come here. Agree. We're going to we're gonna take care of these guys. Keep them busy. 
Oh boy, here we go. Oh shoot. They're all gonna go for the fight, I think. Oh shit, I got detected. I wasn't paying attention at all and I just stopped talking. Oops. Yeah, I should probably redo that. Watch the Pershnikities. What? How did I get detected? He didn't die from that? What the hell is this garbage? Okay, I found the target. How did I get detected? What? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my freaking god. That was stupid. Well, now I'm just in a bad spot, aren't I? No way you're getting through. Uh, I just did. Anyways, uh, that's gonna be it for today. Oh my goodness gracious, that took me like 15 minutes to do. Uh, thank you all so much for watching, and stay tuned for the next part of Let's Play Assassin's Creed 2, when hopefully I'm not being chased down by a million guards. That's gonna hurt. Ow. Son of a gun.